Welcome to India. The India legal team have taken up two OE projects, the 5S workshop and the contract process. The legal department is a factory of documents. A quick and timely ritual of the document has a huge impact on the productivity of the legal team as well as the company. To achieve this, we have initiated the 5S workshop. The contract process has many internal and external customers. We've set up a process to track the timelines involved at each stage of the contract. To standardize contract creation and to bring in transparency resulting in timely conclusion of contracts. So let's meet Devdas for more on contract process. We began the workshop with the voice of our customer. Our head of procurement, SK Jawahar, shared with us his expectations on the contract process. Further, to document the various stages involved in the contract process, we put together a process management and control system. We also identified various contributors from other functions like finance and tax to help us minimize payment related concerns. We put together a checklist of information that will be required ahead of drafting a contract. A data collection template was also prepared which will be used to track the timelines at each stage of the contract process. For instance, the time it takes to circulate the first draft, the time taken at the vendor's end to respond with their comments, right till the final stage when the contract is executed. Based on the analysis of this data, we would be able to standardize the process of timely conclusion of contracts for our procurement. Key account contracts are probably the most important for our company. Ashutosh Singh, Director Key Accounts, flagged off this meeting by sharing with us his and his team's expectations. And what he shared with us was timely conclusion of contracts. The contract creation process involves a number of stakeholders apart from legal. So to understand where exactly time is taken, we evolved a process which lays down all the stages in the contract creation process. We have tracked the key account contracts that we have worked upon in the last one month and we will continue tracking them for another couple of months. After that, we will share this data with all the stakeholders. This will enable us to put in place a good and robust system for timely conclusion of key account contracts. Warehouse is the backbone of any good DST operation. It is important because we are increasing our DST coverage. A quick turnaround time for conducting the due diligence and final execution of the agreement without compromising on the quality of work has now become critical. Under the process of OE, we have tried to capture the various steps and the time required from the identification of the property to the final execution of the agreement. The various steps include the availability of document, title search, negotiation with the owners at various levels for finalization of the terms and conditions. The first step for a good process is good quality input, for which we have already prepared a checklist required for documents for warehousing and rental agreements. We have started tracking the time on a day-to-day -day basis of the contract process. This would help us to standardize and deliver results within the time frame. We had an impression that OE is meant for operation rather than legal. But the OE workshop in the legal has given us an insight to look into certain aspects, whereby we can continue to enhance our processes, productivity and efficiency in the legal function. This was demonstrated by us in OE workshop. OE training program was an eye opener for us in the legal function. I am sure by implementing this, we will achieve amazing results in our day-to-day -day functioning. The legal department went through the 5S program to improve document filing, retrieval and retention. The first step of 5S is sought, which means removal of unnecessary items. As part of this step, all unwanted documents were removed from the workplace. Thereafter, a place for every document was allocated and the documents were kept at the designated place. During the course of this activity, the entire area was cleaned up. This exercise is being regularly maintained on a day-to-day -day basis to ensure compliance with 5S. This has freed almost 20% of the filing space and resulted in faster retrieval of documents. 
Ultimately, operational excellence is all about participation.